Hello, my beautiful wildflowers. How are you today? Alexis here with Oat Modesty. Well, happy Mask Monday and happy Labor Day. And today I am posting this a little bit later. So that way, maybe in case you might want to go ahead and do a mask with me. And today, the mask I will be using is the one that I really, really come to love. And I actually looked it up and I'm going to go ahead and order it, I think. And I think there might be a Labor Day sale. I'm hoping so. But it's the Neutropathica white tea antioxidant mask and it is by Neutropathica and I'll tell you a little about it but um, aside from that I will go ahead and announce the winner from last week's Mask Monday Ladies giveaway and also share with you my most used skincare routine so I have them all laid out as part of empty so you can see how many empties I have on each of these so if you're interested in seeing what is my trusted and true and what I use every single day skincare please stay tuned <laughs> Hey, welcome back my beautiful wildflowers and as you can see I just got back from the trip to visiting my daughter up in Washington well we went up there just to visit friends and you know visit Washington and go to the Space Needle and do all the fun stuff and we got to do that and I think I posted a few things on my Instagram account if you're interested in seeing the pictures from that trip and also um because when I fly, I am a little bit swollen, as you can see, and I swell up like that because going up at it, you know, altitude and no pressures, so I'm like poof. And so, yeah, and I want to go ahead and do a nice uh, antioxidant mask. So I'm going to go ahead and put this on and I received this not too long ago and I used it once and it has white tea in it and I really, really loved it. And I said, you know what, I'm going to save it for when I need it because it really does feel like that it's nourishing my skin and I feel like, mm, yeah, it needs nourishment. But I'm going to go ahead and put this on, then do the affirmation for the day. And let me tell you a little about this though. It is white tea and antioxidant mask by Neutropathica. And it is $62 actually, and it comes in a jar normally, normally, which I'm not really crazy about because I do prefer the tube. And it says a creamy, nutrient-rich mask that blends antioxidant-rich white tea, hydrating barrage seed oil, and soothing aloe vera to hydrate firm and replenish devitalized uh, skin. And I think that's why I like it because I think it does, I remember that clearly, that it does... Um, feel really revitalized and firmed afterwards. So I'm supposed to just go ahead and put this on. Uh, ooh, and you don't have to put a whole lot on here. That's the thing I like about it. And leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes and then rinse off. Did I just drop that somewhere? No, I didn't. <laughs> but there is a lot in this little tube and I used it a couple of times already and look how much I still have. And so, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and rub this on. Oh. And what I love about it is that there is not a strong fragrance. You can kind of smell the, like the barrage. And that's not like a fragrance. It kind of smells like medicine, you know. And so I want to get this on really good. And one thing I'm going to tell you I loved about Seattle when I was up there. My skin just felt so soft because the humidity. But what I hated about it felt like... The bed was wet. Everything was wet. I'm like, what the heck is going on? Why is everything so wet up here? And uh, it's just the humidity, and I wasn't used to it. My hair did something kind of crazy in humidity. It's weird because the humidity in Florida makes my hair, like, really awesome. But up here in Seattle, it's a different humidity because I'll tell you, maybe it's because it doesn't have the heat. It was kind of like, duh. And so, yeah. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so I'm going to leave this on for 15 minutes. And I do have a real quick um, quote that I saw in my motivation app. And here it is. It's kind of hard to see. I don't know why they do the background kind of like that. It's teeny tiny, but I'll read it to you. It says, the truth is that stress doesn't come from your boss, your kids, your spouse, traffic jams, health challenges, or other circumstances. It comes from your thoughts about your circumstances. And that is so very true. And this is by Andrew Surstein or Surstein. And, um, you know, it's true. You know, we do have 
I guess, unpreventable or, well, we can't control uncontrollable stress around us. I mean, we can't control the actions of our boss. I mean, if you're having a problem with them, me, no, I love my boss, thank goodness. Um, or, you know, your spouse, maybe you're having issues, your kids making you nuts. I mean, you really, really cannot control what they do. And, but you can control how you react to them. And sometimes even though as crazy as it makes you, because my daughter drives me crazy, I'm going to tell you right now. I mean, it just, I don't agree with a lot of things, but there's nothing I can do about it. And at one point I was just fighting that and I was just so stressed out. And I had to just say to myself, you know what, there's nothing I can do. I can be there to support. I can be there to say, you know, good job when I feel she did a good job. But other than that, really, there's nothing I can do to control it. And me trying to control that is what's creating the stress. And so, you know, that's a hard learned lesson, but it's true for everything else. Traffic jam, what are you going to do about it? Take another route. I mean, you can do that. Is And if there isn't, well, you know what? Put on some classical music, jazz music, whatever kind of music you get into. Just chill out, man. And, you know, it's just like relax. And it is what it is. You're not going to control it. Don't fight it because that's exactly what creates, you know, stress. And I frequently have to remind myself this guys I do not have this down pat not even a little bit I have to say you know what I have to remember this okay I can't control it nothing I can do okay let's just relax and play it out so it is what it is so anyway yeah that's that and what I wanted to do with you today real quick because I haven't had a chance to really go through my um uh, my empties, but I want to show you the things that I use the most and I use it every single day. Okay. And the first thing here is the advanced replenishing toner by Polish choice. It's with hyaluronic acid It replenishes and soothes reef skin, reefs, leaf skin looking radiant. And it preserves skin's protection barrier. And it's this one here. And I do so believe in this. I mean, here is a couple of them gone empty. And I do have a third one. And I think I threw away one uh, only because I don't, I don't have any more room for my empty basket. So, yeah, this is something I use every day, twice a day after I cleanse my face in the morning and evening before bed. Because what this does is it's not just a toner. It has, um, and it's not, it's a milky color and it's not clear. It has no alcohol and it just leaves my skin so plump feeling. And when I go to sleep, I like that feeling. When I, you know, put on my makeup, I like that feeling. So I, I swear by this stuff and I will continue to use it. And that's that. And then the next thing, I'm going to see if I can do it in order of how I apply it. And this one is Polish Choice C15 Super Booster with vitamin C and E and ferulic acid for all skin types. And it's this boost one. You know, I'm, I'm going to be totally honest with you. You know how much I love, love, love The Ordinary. I just cannot find a vitamin C that just is as good as this. And I think there is one, but I just don't like the texture. I don't, I like my vitamins and more like a water type and not oil because I put other things on my skin. Maybe at night it wouldn't be so bad, but this to me cannot be beat. I love this. And these are good for about six months. And um, because it's vitamin C and it should be, if you see vitamin C that says it's good for like a year, yeah, that's wrong. It's not, yeah, you're not getting the benefit. Matter of fact, my bad. This is good for three months. I, you know, I was thinking six months. Uh, that is the max, depending on what it's suspended in the vitamin C itself. But this one is for three months only. And as you notice, I have three empties. Okay, this is something I trust. This is what keeps my skin um, looking, you know, really even and gets rid of all the dark spots. And especially because you can't help it, even though you put on sunscreen, I'm the crazy about sunscreen, you're still going to get exposed. And this antioxidant vitamin C really helps to get rid of the free radicals. And if you're not using vitamin C, you need to add vitamin C to your routine. And here it is right here, my empties, my three empties. I have one going, of course. And that's that. And then the next thing I want to share with you, I have a couple of this. And this is, you probably have heard about this recently. I've been using this for a long time. And this is the Argeroline solution. And this is what, I mean, it blew up recently. And um, TikTok, it, they call it uh, Botox in a Bottle. 
you know, and also um, dermatologists have hopped on and said, yeah, it, it works, but it's not permanent. It does help to do this, you know, while you put it on. And the Argiline, Argiline solution, 10%, and targets the appearance of dynamic facial lines. And guys, I've been using this a while before it blew up, and I know it works. And so here's a couple of bottles, and I'm going to see if I can get it close to you one bottle so you can see how that looks. Here it is, Polish Choice, I mean Polish Choice. This is by Ordinary. I've been using this for a long time. It's under $10 per bottle. Guys, don't go out there spending $50, you know, $40. You don't need to. This one actually works and it's, it's backed by science. And so here it is. And I have a couple of these already empty and I actually have more somewhere in there if I dig around. I do use it. It does work for dynamic uh, lines. Just remember the dynamic lines are different from static lines. Static lines are ones that do not move. Let's say you have a very uh, distinct line that goes across your forehead. It doesn't move. It's not created by like this action, right? But it's actually there from years of maybe frowning or whatever. It doesn't work on that. It works on static, I mean on dynamic lines, the one that's moving constantly because it stops your face from really moving as much as it, the skin from moving um, as much as it could. And in order to get rid of those um, static lines, you will have to get Botox. And um, it, that's a personal choice. Yeah, I've never had that. But, um, you know, it's not something that I'm, I'll, I'll never say never, because you never know. But, um, you know, one of those things that you need to get Botox if that's what you're interested in. So, but perfect for dynamic lines. And the next thing that I use is the amino acids. I always use some kind of amino acids. And this one here is a concentrated hydration support formula. And it is B5 and it is by the ordinary. And this is also again, clinical formulation. Here it is, couple of them empty. Let me show you closer up what that looks like. Sorry about that. I had it next to my, my caffeine and it's like yellow. Okay. So there it is. And let me see. Can you see that? Mm, I'm hoping you can see that somehow. Okay. And this is something that I also use day and night. All of these things I use day and night. Okay. And I don't use a whole lot. I mean, so far it's vitamin C, argyroline, and this stuff here. And that's pretty much what I use. Okay. And this one, supports you should always use antioxidants also antioxidants really help to support your skin underneath and really helps to um uh, support um the growth and the turnover cell turnover okay and so that's really good and one thing i it and one thing I do use aside from that for like really maximum cell turnover, I'll share that with you in a minute, but I almost forgot my cleanser this is my cleanser, and this lasts a while this is good for like a year is it or six months. This is good for six months. As you notice, the ordinary, they don't last for a long time. Why? Because they don't preserve it and they don't put a lot of chemicals in there that's unnecessary. It's clinically proven to work. And I don't mind. I can get through this in six months. I can get through this in a month and a half. So three months is fine. So yeah, that's another thing. Don't look for something that just lasts for 24. No skincare lasts for 24 months. And if it is, it's junk. Okay, so take a look, even a year, some of the things, yes, one year, but um, you know, not like vitamin C and just kind of it, amino acids, keep that in perspective. And this one here is actually a squalene cleanser. I love this cleanser. And every time I take makeup off, this comes off with just without a struggle. I use this and I also do use the zero depending. And this one is a squalene based face cleanser and makeup remover. And um, this actually, it, it turns into kind of like a milky formulation. You squeeze it into your hand. You have to kind of like hold your hand like this until it warms up. And it kind of turns like a little oily. And then you put it all over your face. But when you, and then you kind of like rub where your um, mascara is. And I use a, a makeup remover, the little, um, the pad, uh, the reusable one. And I just kind of wipe it away and then rinse. And it's just clean after that. And then I use um, soap, uh, but a soapless cleanser after that to get some of the extra oil off if I don't want it on there, but you don't need to. But yep, this is something I use every day. And then another thing I use is, I think everybody knows I use this, it's called the Buffet, and this is peptides. It's a multi-peptide formula, and this is a big bottle. So 
I go through it and I usually buy the big, big bottle because it is available and it's about $23 for the big bottle, but it lasts for 12 months, which makes sense because this is multi-technology peptide serum. It's not antioxidant. It's not vitamin C, anything like that. And so it does make sense that it could last for a year. And what this does, it says, um, the, la, 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 clinically formulated with integrity and it, this just allows my skin to just really be taut. And I know the difference when I don't put this on. I'm like, why is my skin not feeling really tight and taut and really pretty and supple? Because I forgot my peptides. So definitely very good thing. I only use this actually in the morning. I don't use them at night before I go to bed. And I just put this in the morning. And so that way when I put on my makeup, it's just like really nice, you know, nice and tight. Okay, and the next thing I'm gonna share with you, this is my written A. I don't really share too much about this because it is prescription only. And I do go through these, as you notice, there's two of them here. And yeah, and this is the, uh, this is like a retinol, but I mean, retinol on steroids pretty much. And it doesn't have to go through the thing that you find. And uh, you have to be careful when you buy retinol, like in the um, cos uh, cosmeceuticals or, co you know, cosmetics. Because a lot of times it's not effective because it has to go through a couple of stages before it can turn into the formulation. It has to go through some changes in your skin before it does anything. And so, whereas retin A does not, but it does take um, a prescription. I use the strongest um, dosage, which is 0 0.1 and it's called tretinoin. That is the, like the, um, the name trade, um, the, not the trade name, but the brand name of it. And, but it is written a, it's typically used for really bad acne. And what it helps to do is it turns over your cells and your skin. So that way it constantly, it helps to build back collagen that you're losing when you get older. And that was discovered accidentally while they were doing clinical testing for actually for severe acne. And so, yeah, and it is, um, let me see what it says about it. Okay, so tretinoin 0.1% steric acid isopropyl mystrate paluxio 40 stearate sterile alcohol, xanthum, um, and ascorbic acid, butylated hydroxytoline, and purified water. And it comes with a huge warning. It could, if you use this incorrectly, you could completely mess yourself up. I mean, I've seen people like get really bad flaky and I, that's never happened to me because I follow directions. So yeah, if you're interested in getting this, you need to see your dermatologist and get them to agree. I know sometimes they will not. I know, Stephanie, I don't know if you were ever successful in getting that. I know you were having problems where your dermatologist didn't really want to write a prescription for you on that. So yeah, and it all depends and yeah. It, it is what it is, but uh, I do swear by this. I use that every night, okay, before I go to bed. And the final thing that you guys know that I use all the time, and I think I threw away the third one on vacation. I should have brought home the empty so I could show you, but I'm like, you know what? I'm not going to carry an empty across, the, you know, the borders just so I can, yeah. Is my sunscreen. And this is by Paula's Choice. And as you guys know, this is my gold standard. And this is what I use every single day because what I love about it, it's youth extending daily flu, uh, dehydrating fluid with SPF 50. I love, 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 love this stuff because it does not pill with anything. But I think I have found something that's equally as good, um, but it's not SPF 50. I think it's 46 and it's by Shiseido and it's their latest SPF and it comes with hyaluronic acid. I've been testing it. I'm very, you know, I'm very hopeful and that it'll work. So anyway, my beautiful wildflowers, that's it. Those are my most frequently used skincare. So things that I will, you know, stand behind no matter what. And it's time tested for many years. So yeah, if you have any questions, put it below. But in the meanwhile, I got to get this off and let's hop on over to see who won last week's giveaway. I'll be right back. Go to commercial break. Okay, my beautiful wildflowers, here we are again. Mass Monday ladies. And this is the drawing for the winner from last week's giveaway. And so what I did was I gone ahead and put the YouTube video URL as usual 
and filtered duplicate users and filtered comments based on specific text, which was Memorial. And I totally don't know why I kept saying Memorial Day because I totally knew it was Labor Day, right? And so I'm like, okay, a couple of people corrected me and said, uh, I think it's Labor Day. And yes, you are absolutely correct. And again, happy Labor Day. And so let's see how many comments we received. And it doesn't matter what day it is. It's just a nice day. So here we go. And I have 24 unique comments. That's a little bit lower than usual, but that's okay. And let's hop on over here and let's start the random drawing. Okay. Gail McAfee and Gail had to say happy Mass Monday. Congrats to the winner. I'm ready for the end of summer, which began after Memorial Day for us here on the East Coast. Okay, so let's see. Let's go ahead and see if Gail is publicly subscribed. And I have a feeling she is because I see her in the comments almost every day, if not every day. And so let's go ahead and pop on over here. And let's see which channels... And let's go on ahead down. You know what? Oh, I, I thought maybe I saw it, but I'm like, you know what? Let's not take that chance. Okay. Sorry about that. I think I'm banging into this camera stand here. And we will go ahead and say Command F and Oat, H-A-U-T-E. And there I am, Oat Modesty. And congratulations, Gail. And you know what to do within 48 hours. Please let me know you've seen the video and go ahead and send me your mailing address and I will be happy to send you your goodies. And you know, you can find my um, address at uh, oat.modesty on Instagram or you can find it underneath all of the details on every video is my email address. So congratulations again, Gail. And now back to our regular programming. Okay, congratulations, Gail. Good job. And I will go ahead and send you your package. As I said in a video, 48 hours, you have 48 hours to notify me. So yeah, congratulations again. Alrighty, my beautiful wildflowers. As I said, I really do love, love, love this mask and it makes my skin just feel like you know I know it's re revitalized for real and it feels like a little bit plumpy but I did go ahead and put my um my toner on as I always do when I rinse off anything I go directly so with my face a little bit moist put my toner on and then I did go ahead and slap on my uh, vitamin C so that way it has time to absorb and I really don't like to be sitting by my window when I do that but you know I figure I'm only here for about two minutes and then I'll go ahead and move over and start you know doing the rest of my face and things like that so yeah really really love this mask and like I said I what did I say $62 a jar only thing yeah $62 the only thing I don't like about that is that it's in a jar you know in an open jar and you know mm, I don't like things to get into the air and it doesn't really say how big this is either and but it does have a bunch of stars as well oh it is 1.69 ounces 1.69 ounces and they do have a like a travel one which is tiny for 22 dollars still that's a lot so god they need to send me more of these so anyway my beautiful wildflowers let me know what you think and please Put any comments below. And if I added any value, please hit like. And if you haven't subscribed yet and you like this type of content, please do consider subscribing. And the button is below. And also, hit all, ring the bell. And so that way you know every time I upload a brand new video. Alrighty, my beautiful wildflowers. I want to get this edited and up for you We're still on a Monday. So, okay. I want you to have a good day. Good night. Good week. Good weekend. Whenever you're watching this. But remember, it is Labor Day. And I have a, instead of a mask Monday giveaway, but I'm going to do a Labor Day giveaway with maybe a couple of makeup pieces and stuff. So let's use the word labor. I'm going to write that down. Labor. Labor. L-A-B-O-R. For next week. So, got it? All right, my beautiful wildflowers. Just remember, in a field of roses, be a wildflower and never sweat the small stuff. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>
getting hot up here. It's supposed to hit 104, 105. And so I'm gonna have to tell my husband, so hurry up and put the air conditioner up here because it's getting hot. And this is where my makeup lives. And I don't wanna ruin my makeup, yeah. And I did pick up a bunch of new makeup um, that I need to go ahead and um, talk to you guys about. Something's great. And I know that you know that I picked up the, the Tweed collection from Chanel. And I did have a chance to go ahead and use it over the, you know, the three days, four days that I've been gone. And so I have some, you know, information about that and what I thought about it and actual use and the cost and all that stuff. So, yeah, guys, that's coming up. Uh, I have a lot of material I need to cover. and But I did go ahead and cover a little bit about the stuff that I use, you know, frequently with skincare. And so I'm glad I got that done because my my box again like really really you know full so yeah alrighty guys I want you guys to be really careful out there it's hot if it's you know if you live in a place where it's like really really hot and you don't have air conditioning go to your local library if you can even your local church and you know what if you want to find out about what you know Islamic people do go to an Islamic community center they'll be happy to accept you and they'll be happy to let you shelter you know and, and while this heat wave is going on so do whatever you need to do but please be careful okay because it is hot out there and if those of you who are like in in a different climate of rain and craziness I mean be careful as well okay alrighty my beautiful wildflowers you know I love you guys from the very bottom of my left ventricles so until next time I'll see you guys later. Mwah. Bye!